as we had discussed in our expected question topics geography questions this time were highly predictable some of the questions which were asked in the geography talked about ocean currents now these topics are some of the topics that we have already covered in our complete video course and a lot of them are also part of the youtube video so uh, how, what are the factors that affect ocean currents how ocean currents have an important role in fishing because it's the zone where the cold water uh, cold current and the warm current meet you meet you have the most thriving fishing locations of the world so on the map itself you can represent those now rubber producing countries and the environmental issues because of deforestation because of climate change because of shortage of labor which is a major concern post pandemic early uh, uh, rubber which is a labor intensive industry is facing some of the major threats straits and isthmus the difference between the two we have covered extensively so uh, uh, a mass connecting two water bodies and a land mass which separates the uh, the water bodies it's basically how we understand it uh, troposphere the layers of atmosphere and most of the weather phenomena which occur in the lower most layer which is the troposphere which we have covered in our separate lecture on the layers of atmosphere now another important question is extremely interesting and that talks about new technology of scarce resources now we have scarce resources so the new technology of scarce resources and its relation to globalization how that technology has to be brought globally let's say if we talk about um, lithium lithium being used for electric vehicles now the mining of lithium is extremely limited uh, child is one of the countries which is the largest producer of lithium uh, but we do have this resource which is extremely scarce now with new technologies how can you actually um, get the best out of the scarce resources and utilize them with minimum amount and maximum output and with globalization the phenomena are changing we are not now solely dependent on oil producing nations there are newer forms of technology which are bringing in better uh, avenues even in the field of renewable and non renewable sources uh, we have more options that are explored so uh, those are scarce resources for example geothermal is again a scarce resource so how uh, technology can help grow the geothermal resource is again an interesting aspect so we have seen that these technologies can bring in great change globally but the only idea has to be the technology has to be cost effective the next is uh, in india as a country we have seen numerous tribes now each tribe have their own culture their way of language religion literature worship but still they have a single common unity feature and that is what has to be explained in this answer the idea is the feeling of oneness the feeling of being an identity in itself and that is the crux of this concept here so those were some of the questions which related to the fields of geography social geography which were part of your question paper but yes more or less the questions were extremely direct and uh, were extremely predictable as we had discussed in our paper so if you have any questions feel free to connect back to us and below are the links uh, which are useful for you so don't miss those have a wonderful day ahead